another common issue that people run into is they may have pressed the emergency stop button. When you press the emergency stop button, what happens is the, um, the system goes into its fail safe mode. So everything stops inside the Viper 1. However, when you release the emergency stop button and it is still, and the Viper 1 is still hooked up to your air compressor, it's going to bleed air and a lot of air really, really quick because it's just passing through all the air from the air compressor in through the Viper 1 and out a vent port. So what's going to happen is it's going to sound like this. The only way to overcome that is to press the start button. And by pressing the start button, that will reset the system and allow you to get back to normal operations where the machine will reset itself and allow you to spray shirts like you would normally. Now we just talked about the emergency stop button and how when it's pressed it'll cease all operation of the Viper 1 and you'll hear the air venting from inside the Viper 1 as long as it's still connected to your air compressor. Now this is a standard feature of the, uh, the Viper 1 so that if there ever is an issue and you have to press the e-stop button it'll cease all operations. However, what it will do is continue to vent out your air compressor. Now what that will do is as it vents air, it's going to also drop in PSI that your air compressor can put out, which means that if you try pressing your start button and your PSI is too low on your air compressor, your Viper 1 won't be able to reset and go back to normal operating mode. In this case, the best thing to do would be to repress your emergency stop button and allow the air compressor to build back up and stop running so that it is at the official uh, correct setting for the PSI that you have it set for. Now, to quickly overcome this so you don't run into this issue, and a lot of times it happens with a smaller air compressor like a one gallon or maybe a two or three gallon air compressor because the tank is so small and you will use up a lot of air really, really quickly, especially if you're venting it off of the, uh, the emergency stop button here as it vents through. So the best way to overcome this is when your air compressor has built back up all of its pressure and it's stopped, quickly release the emergency stop button and press the start button. This will reset your system and you'll be back to normal operating uh, operations with your Viper 1.